1960. This was the beginning of construction of this 33,000 acre lake created from the Pearl River. Engineers began digging out the spot where the reservoir would sit, initially called the Pearl River Reservoir, but then renamed for then Governor Ross Barnett. The Barnett Reservoir was never created for flood control. It was created out of a need of a reliable supply of drinking water for then rapidly growing city of Jackson. Until then, Jackson had gotten its water supply from the Pearl River, but the river itself was not enough of a water supply to sustain Jackson. However, because of the lake's position north of Jackson, it has become a crucial part of the Middle and Lower Pearl River flood control. The biggest test to date for the reservoir came during the Easter flood of 1979. That's when nearly 20 inches of rain fell on the headwaters of the Pearl River in Leake and Neshoba counties. That's when the Pearl River crested at 43.28 feet, the highest level ever recorded at Jackson. That's almost the time the reservoir spillway located on the Rankin County side of the lake almost gave way. The reservoir pool is normally kept around 297 feet. It can only hold up to 300 feet before the spillway is in danger of activating, meaning the water overtops the dam. Three feet of extra water in a 33,000 acre lake is a lot of water, and what reservoir officials try to do is let the water out in controlled intervals and help control how fast the river downstream rises. This gives people downstream some time to prepare before flood. For 16 WAPT Weather, I'm meteorologist Adam McWilliam.